Scar Squad, come with me on the great Christmas tree adventure. That's right, we're about to head off into the woods and off to find a magical Christmas tree. So my friends, let's get going. Scars, we arrived at the tree farm and we we're just kind of in the car looking around trying to find a perfect tree. As you can see, I'm in the car here looking through the camera trying to find a good one. And I don't know if I can wheel out on that dirt, but we're definitely going to try. There goes mom racing to the trees over there. As you can see, we are on the uh, gravel and we're kind of riding a little bit above because uh, it's not very easy wheeling in gravel, but uh, we got the cutter ready to go so we can cut down the tree. We don't need chicken sauce, no, 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 no. Trying to pick a perfect tree here from the road, but I think we're gonna continue down the road a little farther. All right, I think I found one over here. Just as you can see this one straight ahead. I think that one looks pretty good. It's right by the, right by the dirt path here, so we don't have to go into the mud, which is a plus for sure. All right, so here comes mom because we have found two trees that could potentially be uh, ones we could choose. So we have the right tree, which is tree number one, and tree number two on the left-hand side. I'm leaning towards the left. Uh, what do you guys like? Do you like the right or the left? I'm leaning towards the left. They're very similar, and they're just right off the path, as you can see, so we don't have to go into the mud area, and of course, that's the danger zone. So I think that's pretty good. Let me know which one do you guys think is best. All right, we have picked our tree. We've got our saw, which is surprising they let us people have saws like this, very dangerous. All right, so I don't know if I can get it, get the uh, the tree cut, so we're gonna have to watch my dad over here do it. So let's see what he's got here. Oh, he's gonna get that, meat, that knee right in the mud. As you can see, this is a very quality tree. Look at this thing. Very, oh, it's all wet. It's all wet, but anyway, um, okay. Here we go, so our saw situation over here, we had to get our own saw. Oh, oh you're bleeding. Yeah, ah. injury already. Already an injury for a U-cut Christmas tree. <laughs> uh, this saw, like we talked about before, not, not quite sharp enough, not quite sharp enough. So as you can see here, we're having to go deep into the tree here to try to get this thing cut. So how's it coming, Dad? It's getting there, about halfway through. Got How thick is that trunk? It's about that big. All right, how many injuries? Two or one still? Just one so far. Just one injury so far? Right, back to it. Any moment this tree is about to come on down. So we are waiting just like the price is right. Come on down. Oh, here it comes. Oh, there it is. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, how are we gonna get this home? Did you bring rope and stuff? I brought some rope, but they'll have to get some extra twine. And there it is, we've got our tree headed off to get all like bundled up and uh, hopefully we can find Elvis. And I don't know if you guys know who Elvis is, but Elvis is a donkey who lives in this farm. He roams around, so we're gonna try to find him. Trying to find a way over to Elvis, but it's not so easy with all of this mud in a chair that's on wheels. So we're uh, trying to find our way over to Elvis somehow.
right, Scars, we've got our tree loaded up and ready to go. As you can see, look at that. That's a magnificent tree there. It's very, very muddy. Uh, my wheels are atrocious, but uh, we are gonna somehow get that up onto the car. And I'm just over here supervising, of course, watching and making sure all safety measures are uh, taken into account here. Almost got it up there. And there it is, up on the tree. That is a Northwest best Christmas tree. I'm over here just supervising. Just making sure our safety standards are met, of course. Uh, but that is a magnificent tree. And welcome home and as you can see it is an icy wonderland out there right now look at all that beautiful ice every once in a while a giant chunk was just gonna fall off the side of one of the houses and it's super crazy loud but uh, as you can see look at that isn't that cool oh, absolutely amazing but uh, welcome home and let's take a look at the tree ah, it was so cold out there my friends but look the trees in the background and there's even a cat back there look right right there she's playing with her toys and there's Jelly, of course, playing with her toys. But look at our awesome tree. Isn't that amazing? Locally grown tree, looking all super awesome. But I know what you guys really wanna see. It's right there. <laughs> there's Jelly. Hi, Jelly, say hi to the camera. No, no, she, she is just too busy with her toys. Her Christmas toys, she only gets to see those uh, once a year, I suppose. But uh, guys, Thank you so much for coming along as we went on a great Christmas tree adventure and hopefully you enjoyed seeing the ice and I want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas and I would love to see your Christmas tree pictures on Twitter so definitely follow the link in the description head on over to my Twitter and send me a picture of your Christmas tree I'd absolutely love to see it and I want to wish you guys a very Merry Merry Christmas and we'll see you in the next video.